I'm not on the Supreme Court, so I didn't get a vote, but it is my unalienable right to express my opinion. Oh, say, can you see by the dawn's early light, warm summer rain on a fresh mowed lawn, the distant roar of thunder and garden fresh roses. Curtis Turner, Babe Ruth, and Hank Aaron. Joe Weatherly, Fireball Roberts, and fearless Fred Lorenzen. Arnold Palmer and Bob Cousy. Sun-dried bedsheets, a puppy squeaky innocent bark, what so proudly we hailed. Cousins, sisters, brothers, parents, aunts, and uncles, grandparents, and kids. Playground laughter, the morning paper, and the evening news. Dale Earnhardt, Daryl Waltrip and Rusty Wallace, head-to-head on Bristol's banking. The shrill cry of an air wrench as it anticipates a pit stop. At the twilight's last gleaming, faded jeans and well-worn sneakers, silent falling snow, logs crackling in the fireplace, and bacon sizzling in the pan. A wood chopper on a nearby hill. Big Bill France, oh yes. Whose broad stripes and bright stars... The concert of a springtime bird at sunrise suddenly startled chipmunks. The white-tailed deer at Pocono. Doors that only creak when it's dark and Halloween. Ribs on the grill with friends and Tucker's music. Ned Jarrett, Junior Johnson, Banju Matthews, and Tiny Lunn. David Pearson, Cotton Owens, and Jack Smith. Jim Hunter, Richard Petty, and Bobby Isaac. Gentlemen, start your engines. Play ball. Through the perilous fight, lonesome, laboring midnight trains, firm, caring handshakes, Chinooki oysters on the half shell, God bless America and anybody's alma mater, jet trails aloft, bent by the wind, beautiful, playful crutch and his love, the Golden Gate Bridge, the gusty roar of finely tuned racing engines, pit stops with ballet precision, The white flag and one lap to go. Over the ramparts we watch were so gallantly streaming. Vine ripe tomatoes, silver queen corn, and Vidalia onions. Sunday morning church bells, waves against a seawall. The metallic whine of a distant trail bike. The Darlington Stripe and the Southern 500. Bristol, Martinsville and Richmond. Daytona in February. Little Bud Moore. And the rocket's red glare, the bombs bursting in air, the unending honks of a southbound wedge of geese, largemouth bass cracking the water surface at daybreak, topwater fishing, Santee Cooper, the rustle of leaves beneath boots in the fall woods, Richard Petty's hat and sunglasses, his smile. Tire mounters who never seem to finish working. The look-alike Elliott brothers. Hot dogs at Martinsville. Glenn and Leonard Wood. The crisp, clean smell of Rockingham in October. My old dog Otis. Gone but not forgotten. Gave proof through the night that our flag was still there. Pickup trucks and golden retrievers. Turkey, dressing, and giblet graving at Thanksgiving. New York City in December. Military color guards. Good night, Chet. Good night, David. Strawberry shortcake. Drivers meetings. Bobby Allison spunk and Judy Allison spirit. Junie Don Levy smile. Humpy Wheeler's pre race shows. Riverside and Ontario now gone. Daryl Derringer's giggle. Ageless Buck Baker. Fans who care. Scores who work tirelessly. Oh, say, does that star-spangled banner yet wave? Silent night. Teenage shrills on an amusement park adventure. Batman. The inside smell of a brand new car. Election day. Easter eggs. The Rocky Mountains. Little smiling babies. Davy Allison and Kyle Petty winning their first races. The meaningful beauty of the Hayride 500. Harold Kinder on the flag stand. Give him one more lap to go, Harold. Unical's pit crew competition at Rockingham. Or the land of the free. Hud's fried chicken drumettes. An incredibly delicious coleslaw. The crack of a bat when it strikes a well-hit ball. People who share. 
the thud of a horseshoe when it rings the stake. Napa Valley. Honesty. Ditto's exuberance and intelligence. Engine builders, tire changers, fabricators, and jackman. Truck drivers, Phoenix. Crowded infields and packed grandstands. Press box banter. Vetter drivers spending their time with eager rookies. Friendships that never fade. And the home of the brave. Nobody can burn my American flag. The cloth it is made of from perhaps might yield to a flame, but not my flag. It will forever wave.